So guys, today I want us to talk about one particular document called Permesso per motivo di lavoro autonomo. That is self-employed permesso di soggiorno that most of times a lot of people don't respect this document, especially Africans to be precise we black people we don't respect the autonomous documents but you see this bangladesh this pakistans around this mini markets they are using this autonomous to do all of these things it will be very difficult for you to see bangladesh in a fabrica they like to run their own business so why can't we also run our own business like black people we have a lot of people out there who want to run their own business they don't want to be working under some people right now that i'm recording this video it is almost 10 27 and your alarm is ready for the next day if not you will wake up late and if you go to work you and your couple will be having issues but someone who is autonomous someone who is running his or her own business he wake up the time that he want and they go to work so that is one advantage of the autonomous document now once you have protection especially or cases especially and you want to convert you can convert it to lavoro autonomo but you need to show a legit business you need to tell the questura that you are working you go to the agency at the entrata then they will open a partita eva for you for example if you are a baba you can open partita eva if you want to open african shop you do one or two three courses then you go and open your partita eva and you are ready to go now i have the article here but what i want to tell you is that this document is very very important if you are holding it you are like someone who is holding lavoro subordinato you can travel you can change it to eu long-term permit if you have all the requirements so it's such an amazing document now permesso per motivo di lavoro autonomo for the self-employed to be eligible to convert your existing permesso into permesso per motivo di lavoro autonomo you need to have so, for example, if you have Lavoro Subordinato and now you decide to open your own business, you can also convert that Lavoro Subordinato to Lavoro Autonomo. Your national passport, these are the documents that you need. A valid permesso di soggiorno. Documents showing that you have a legitimate business or a freelancer work. But the documents you need depends on your business or the freelancer work every kind of business that you want to do they have the kind of partita eva that they will open for you the kind of taxes that you will be paying now you need to also prove that your annual income is higher than the amount that under italian law exempts you from health care spending the minimum is eight thousand two hundred and sixty three euros 31 cents so you need to prove that your annual income will be like eight thousand there about for example even if you are earning 800 monthly as self-employed worker i think you can conquer this amount so it's not a big deal you, you see bangladesh you see pakistans around doing their own business now how long will it take to get the permesso per motivo di lavoro autonomo? The length of the process may vary from one questura to another, but in general, it takes several months. So if you are converting it to the lavoro autonomo, it takes time and at times it also depends on the questura. How long is it valid for? Now let's look at the validation. The first time you get the permesso, it will be valid for two years. When you renew it, your new permesso will be valid for three years and can be renewed again. So first time they will give you like two years. If you go for the second renew, they can decide to give you three years now how can i renew this kind of permesso you will need to prove the same documentation you provided when 
you first applied for the permesso but you will need to prove up to date version so for example if you open the partita eva the taxes always come so if you go to renew you need to present the current tax that you have paid showing that your partita eva is ongoing so now what rights do i have as a holder of a permesso per motivi the lavoro autonomo you can work in italy but not any other european countries with the lavoro autonomo travel outside of italy so you can travel outside italy access the public education system ask to bring your family to italy through family reunification register with the registry office of your local commune apply for the permesso Uwe per sojournanti di lungo periodo to work or study in another European country after five years of living in Italy and if you meet certain conditions. Note, you cannot stay in a government-run reception center with either type of permesso. So if you are holding this autonomy, you can't stay in government reception center. The same thing applies to people who are holding lavoro subordinato. You can't stay in government reception center. Once you change your documents to lavoro autonomo or lavoro subordinato, meaning you are on your own, you can take care of yourself. So you don't need any government reception center again so that is the explanation and the importance of permissive di soggiorno per motivi di lavoro autonomo if you don't still understand anything you can let me know in the comment section below we are here to give you all the solutions to your immigration problems please if you have not yet subscribed to the channel what are you waiting for do me a favor subscribe to the channel and be part of the family and if you have not yet followed us on facebook official cracker tv you can follow me on facebook try to like the page and also share the videos for me and guys tap tap send still remains in our one mobile app you can use to wire money back to africa with tap tap send you don't pay any sending fee or any commission and their rates are very very high you can download on google play or app store register in your first transfer just add my promo code official niger in capital letters like this they are dashing you five euros ten pounds ten dollars depending on where you are if you're in canada america anywhere in europe you can also use tap tap send to wire money to loved ones in africa until we meet again in the next video please stay safe and stay blessed peace out